Transformers reviews, tech and the news, whatever else I use as a muse. Hit subscribe, I appreciate the views, influences, interest on YouTube. What's going on people, this is Influence and I'm back again with another review. Today I have a much anticipated X-Trans Bots 86 MXX IIB. I know that's a Roman numeral, but right now my brain's not working. Berserker Leader. It's the trailer, the trailer that turns into Minnesota, the bulk of Minnesota, basically. Um, and we're going to get into it. Uh, here's the trailer on Motormaster. And it's it's pretty large. It is pretty large. You can see, you see this a little bit. This is uh, what I did earlier when I tried to practice. Now, a couple things off the bat. This is going to be my first time. I tried to turn it into base mode. I kind of failed. I gave up, actually. And I was tired. It was last night, like 2 o'clock in the morning. So this on screen is going to be the first time I transformed this. Uh, so wish me luck for one. For two, I will have chapters in the description or on screen. I'm not sure. Sometimes I put chapters on screen as soon as it come on. So you know where to go because this is going to be a long video. There's a lot of stuff here, so let's get into it. You get this gun, which is a giant gun, and basically pull it out, and it's big. It's a big gun for a big bot, Minasaur. So you get this sword. My sword has weird stuff on it like this. I don't know what that is. Is it tape or is it glue or is it just discoloration? Discolorization of the plastic? I don't know, but that and this, um, that's how I got it. So there you go. QC issues, which is basically par for the course for X Trans bots these days, and probably always been, but I don't know. I think they're having a little bit more trouble these days. Get this face which is a screaming face i assume the one that's on him is the regular stoic type face you get this card and you get uh tech specs tech spec card of course why not tech spec cards this book pretty thick um it wasn't really helping me that much so we'll see <laughs> Like I said, this is going to be the first time I'm transforming this, so please bear with me. I am going into base mode first, and then I'm going into Minnesota mode. Again, I will have chapters in the description or in the video. And here's the box. We can move this a little bit over here. See the box. Box has this on it. Uh, nice little picture. Old school tech specs. Uh, I got the teams upside down, but you don't really care about the box that much. So we're going to get into this uh, review or get into this transformation. Show this a little bit. It is a big trailer. It's a big boy, but it's more thick than long. It is long, though. I have no other trailers, which is surprising. I don't have Optimus Prime. I don't have his trailer. Uh... And my fans toys is not transformed and I'm not transforming it. <laughs> it's a robot right now. I'm not transforming that thing until I get the last piece. So yeah, here you go with this. This is what it looks like. So we have him with the rest of his team and it looks pretty good. I love the stunner cons. Um, and is okay. He's, Always been a crazy, weird design. So people that complain about him being stuck, like cars stuck on him. I'm not sure why. Like they've never seen the G1 cartoon in their life. He's always been a, a weird design. So he's been a weird dude. So I don't know what to tell you. If you're just now realizing the way you have this on him is this thing right here. Which we can move to the side. I will move underneath. 
So underneath you have a few things, few gimmicks we'll get into. You got this, this thing right here slides into, uh, where's that? Let me see right here, right here slides right here. And that's how it stores. It can't store. However, uh, see if I can get that. No, I can't see that. It's just a handle. It just slides right into this little slot right there. And that's not working. But yeah, it's All right, take my word for it. It usually slides into that little spot. I can't do it while it's on camera. Of course I can't, because why would it? There you go. And it fell off again. Meh, meh, meh. Joke's on me. You have these feet here. I did show that in my little short video. Just pull them out, push them up, pull it out. This one goes down, because these little things block it from moving. And then you can pull these all the way out. They're on sliders. They're really tight. I had no issue with mine falling down or falling or now falling this way. I don't want to do it too hard because it might break it. But you see, it's pretty sturdy. And just like that, it's like the, I don't know what you call them. But they're stilts to feet the thing. Add-on kit. I didn't think it was worth it. I didn't think you needed the add-on kit. I know the add-on kit has some extra stuff for base mode, but you can use what you have. So that's what we're going to do. So this, you just move up here like this, I believe. Um, I think it's like this or something. It's just some extra, extra uh, support. This, you pull those, they're on sliders. Slide them up, extra support again. Slide them up and I don't know if they peg on while they're up. Yeah, they do, they have a peg. So you peg them on while they're up, unpeg it, slide it up, peg it back. I was hoping they did. So then you have support. Now this I didn't really show, so I'll show it now since we're about to get into it anyway. You open this open that if everything's transformed this often falls apart it's a peg there and a peg there that but it, it was off when i got it Let me make sure i don't know if his arms are right if they are he should fit in without his gun of course and his arms aren't right if the arms are just right in there i'm not gonna fool with it because you see it can go in if the arms are just right. It's blocking it because the arms aren't. Um, there we go with that. So moving on right along. You need this out to start base mode. Pull these up. And I almost ripped this off. Yay. You had two two things up here. No. Bust that off, bust that off. After you do that, you wanna get this off of there like that and move this out. This off of here, move this out. You can leave it just like that. Now with this out, you can move these kind of hard, so be careful. Um, I'm gonna try my best to be careful. It kinda, you see how it went in? So let's, let me just see what I can do. You see, there's a lot of like this side overlaps here and this side overlaps here. So there's a lot of that going on. Um, you just got to try to do what you can with that. Trying to get the right angle. Somebody said I would uh, want to jump out the building to, I think, I don't know if that's their exact words, but that was my words last night. So 
I'm, I beat you to it. <laughs> they said I would want to jump off the roof into the snow. And you are not lying. Again, this is like the arm. So get this off. I believe it's pegged on right here. Yeah, there we go. And off of there like that. And then there's a peg here. Move that. But then you have to get this. Make sure it clears that. There you go. Down there. You got this like this. You're a quarter away there. Same thing over here. You pull that away. But you have to be careful. You see this. Uh, this is the little uh, faux part that goes on top of. Um for the arm. So gotta try to get it out like that. And I don't know if this I don't think this is right, or I don't think you have to do anything with that. And you can see why it needs some support in the middle there. <laughs> it's definitely it's definitely uh not being supported. <laughs> you got this like this. We're this is on an armature. Be careful because this armature seems very, very loose. Uh but it spins that way, it spins this way. So you're gonna want it just to get it out the way. Again, move this like this. Move this over here. And you're trying to flip this. There's a panel here that you want to flip. But I think you want to get this stuff together first. Pull that out. Pull this out. Have this flipped up. Pull this down. Put that in there. Flip this, I believe. Uh, and now we're trying to spin this around and get this under here. Now this is a this is kind of a nightmare. But if you can get this over top, get that over top. Be careful with all of this because it is, it does seem flimsy. Even though I'm moving pretty fast, it's, it's really flimsy. It's flimsy. That's all I can say. I don't, I don't know. Um, let me see. I think this goes like this. This goes under here. So now with this this plate right here, you're trying to spin this around on that joint and you're trying to move this so it, it hides underneath and it kind of gives it some support. So you're spinning that around. And some of this, uh, you just gonna well, have to take my word for it because I don't know how I'm gonna be able to show it uh, and still be careful. That's my main objective is to be careful, which is one of the reasons I didn't really practice beforehand because I it's it's I don't want to do it too many times. That's that's all basically. Um, so I'm thinking it should go the other way, not that way. It should go this way. Uh, Switch this at the same time. Yeah, that's putting stress on that. So probably should have had it up like this to begin with. And then you move his head. Like that, I believe.
It's a mess. It's a mess, stay Drew. Uh I can't see. Yeah, don't don't go. Don't go this. <laughs> don't go this route. Don't go this, this way that I'm doing. Don't uh don't do it. You can do what you can do. So that is where it's supposed to be. Uh this goes down like that. Um believe this I don't know how this goes Things like this um, let me see I think the other side is easier so let's move it along to the other area Ugh. Pick it up so I'm not dragging the feet. So now this side, be careful with the fist and just get it out. Get all this together. Uh, then I think you go this route, but you gotta get this out of here. Spin it around. And these panels, they don't, they don't do right. <laughs> they don't do right. They don't, they're not very friendly. You can put panel in there like that. Yeah, they're not, they're not super friendly, so. This goes like that. Goes under here, I believe. Maybe this. This panel. I don't know. I don't know to tell you the truth. Listen. This is about as close as I'm going to get to it. <laughs> about as close as I'm going to get to the base mode. You open up these things up here. Get these open. So listen. Uh, I swear, I ain't never felt this defeat in my life with a, a transformer <laughs> in my life. Like, what the hell? <laughs> Minosaurs you can store underneath, like I showed earlier. And uh, this ain't it, but. It's about as close as I'm going to get to it. Just to show you, <laughs> this is a mess. Like, it's a mess, and it is what it is. And if you, you know, if you got the kit, it's probably a little better if you can get it into some type of mode. But if you got the kit, then you can put the guns up here. But if you don't, you can put the, the regular guns here. They go this one this one's super loose i don't even know why i picked this one um all right let's do this one so you got that you got uh let me get a different one because that's too loose okay that one's not gonna work got this one so you see you see do like they show at your boy right there and <laughs> that's it let me uh i gotta take a picture of this all right this concludes this no i'm just playing i'm just <laughs> i 
I'm just joking. Uh, man, yo, this, woo. Like, never, never. Like, that's this tough. I don't think I ever uh, felt like this after transforming. I like transforming. I'm always the guy that says, I like transforming stuff. I'm that guy. But to tell you, oh, shit. But to tell you the absolute truth, I will never in my life do this again. Ever. I will ever make, I will never make this into this mode. If I sell this, I don't know how I'm going to sell it. I think I'm going to sell it all together. I'm waiting for, I'm going to wait for, I was going to sell it soon, but I'm waiting for fans toys so I can compare them in Minnesota mode and then I'll probably let y'all guys know if I'm selling it because, you know, it's not going to be for scalper prices or whatever. I mean, or market value. It, it'll be market value, but it won't be. I ain't trying to wild out. You know what I mean? I mean, you can see that it, it, this is going to be loosey goosey by time. And if you don't want it, I'll, I'll listen. But this ain't a commercial for selling it because I don't even know if I'll get there. Might not like fans toys. I might just want to keep fans toys as a robot. And call it a day. But who knows? Who knows? We'll see. But I do tell you one thing. I'll be shipping it just all together. I'll be wrapping it up in bubble wrap. Extra tight. Because this, this right here. Let me go handheld for a minute. Because you guys see. Like... Look at all these panels. I don't know. If that's all they did when they redesigned it, I'm sorry. I'm not going to complain. All right, let's get to, to the main event. If you haven't fast forward this already, move these. Um, Panels, I believe these, oh, these are like that. That's why they, that's probably why, because they're supposed to be in here, I believe, tabbed. So they weren't, they're already moved down. Then you gotta move, uh, get these tabs. Wait, where's the tabs? Right here. Flip these in, flip these in. So now let's let's move this over here. Um, I'll just leave it like that and get this arm out the way. So we can deal with this mess or, or leave it dealt with. Um, Yeah, I just I just basically fold his arm out the way so I can fool with all this. And over here, I'm going to do the same. Just get this arm out the way so you don't have to worry about it. You see, it's just away from the body. All this again, you got to flip this back around, which <laughs> is great. It's great, great. It's not too bad if you know what you, if you do it in the right direction. Like you just got to figure it out. Get these horns out the way cuz they definitely aren't great. It's like a puzzle. <laughs> it's like a puzzle. That's all. I mean, this is a transformer. Puzzle robots. And this is super loose right here. Like super loose. So that's that's bad. 
Yeah, like this is super loose. I'm hoping that's not important. <laughs> Damn. Yeah, this, this, uh, let me make sure. Uh, don't look like it's. Yeah, it's not, uh, it's not great right there. But what you gonna do? And this keeps falling down, but I believe it's supposed to. I'm just gonna move these out the way just for the sake of the transformation. Some panels right here. I think these um some of these steps i don't i don't know i'm not sure about them so bear with me no i've been saying that but this this is a beast and there's a panel here that you gotta move down some of the steps i don't think they got the steps right personally <laughs> so move that down and then you turn this around like that and you put it up there. I think that will make this panel easier to get to put in. Uh, don't know, tell you the truth. Maybe to make it harder. You need a tool. So you get this panel. This panel has to bend out the way. Uh, it's on, uh, it's kind of hard to see. It's on a thing like this. So then you can just spin around and have it go up here like this and go right there. And then I'm going to try to get these panels. Maybe that has nothing to do with these panels. I don't know, but we'll see. And you can't see nothing. So these panels right here, they're supposed to go in. There we go. So you got to flex, you got to flex this to put them in. And I don't like that, but I think it did make it easier to put that, that other piece around first. Then here you, this goes up here, but you have to slide it up. Just lock it in. Um, not sure what these fake wheels are for, but I guess I'll see. Slide it up, lock it in. I don't know if it's just for the, Support of the base mode or what? Then these pieces this is the back of the back of the truck here. Move that down, fold them up. Move this down. Yeah, this is never coming out of Minnesota mode. Fold it up. I believe you fold this down. And the holes you created now go this way. Yeah, gotta try to flip this through here. Uh, don't know how. Oh, uh, okay. Again, it just goes through. Then it's on a little hinge system right there. And you hinge it down so this is like flat. And then this goes down like this, uh, I believe. <laughs> yeah, goes down like this. Make sure it's all the way flat. There we go. Here's this chest. Looks like it's, there we go. Getting somewhere now, getting somewhere. I don't know where we getting, but we getting somewhere. This look on camera that looks scratched up. Maybe it's like a little. Yeah, I just gotta wipe it off. That's how the sword looks. It's like the plastic is stressed, but it's not stressed. These these tires that you push through, pull them out like that. Pull this side out, and then this goes like this. I believe so. Like this. And you know, it's like a double hinge. Oh, 
Oh, no. I don't know what I'm doing wrong. There we go. Oh, man. I didn't like that sound right then. Yeah, so that's that's not that's not the best sounding thing in the world. Is this thing right here? You can pull these out um, and push these up in there. Do it same thing on the other side. It's identical. I'm doing it from here. I'm just um for now I'm just gonna leave them like like in but I do know they go in the feet I believe the feet are back how back how I mean I thought another piece was first but I guess not so just open these up split these and then move I'm gonna move the these things up. It's a lot of stuff that's just in the way. It's a lot of uh like the panels are close together and the the joints are see how that is and it's like rubbing when you move it, it, it if you don't have it in the exact position like over here. You see how you got to have this like in a more out position like that. But if you have it in here, they rub right here. So just just some tips. Uh, <laughs> just some tips. Tips and tricks. So these sides right here. Um, they're like tabbed in, tabbed in and tabbed in. So they come up like that. I don't know what to do with this yet. Uh, gotta see and untab that right there. Starting to see his foot and uh, I think it's die cast. Uh, let me see. Put this up if you didn't already do that. I thought I already did it, but maybe not. It's tight right here. I mean, it's tight everywhere. It's <laughs> Jesus, like that is crazy. Or maybe it's somewhere else. Maybe I don't have it. No, that's the only place it's still going to. Oh, maybe because I don't have this. What am I doing? Pull this out. All the way. Pull this out, yeah. That's that would be why. <laughs> that would be why. Pull that down, and now you can pull this out. Whew. Yeah. Starting to get, starting to get there, kind of. So I'm trying to make sure. Um, these pieces right here, you see this black piece? It's a black piece right here. Hold it like that so you can get this out the way, I believe. Or maybe it's just, yeah, oh, okay. It's just tabbed in to the sides right here. You still might wanna fold it out just to get it out the way, but then you can put it back just so it don't break and then you got this right here. This, all this starting to come together, starting to get it. Uh, you want to flip all this out. Everything that can flip out, I believe, flips out. I think. <laughs> flip that out like this. So you can flip this again. Flip that out, flip this out, flip this out, flip this up, flip this forward, flip this around, flip this to it, flip this do it. Don't forget to flip this fluid. 
<laughs> over here. All right, it's late. It's late, people. You just don't know how long I've been doing this. Y'all seen the cut version, and it's long. So <laughs> don't, don't. If you made it this far, I wish I had a hundred dollars to give you, cause. Okay, now pull this up. I believe this can go up like this. Flip this down over here. You got pigs, you got pigs. Um Did you see that? I'll show it on the other leg. Peg dead in, peg dead in. Pegs feel really, really tight, really solid. I think that's cool. Oh, I had to fool with that. So flip this. When you flip this up, there's this thing right here. Pull that down, but you gotta kind of like bend it around and it fills in that little gap back there. Makes it a little more sturdier. Then when you flip this, it's two pegs. You see the pegs. Make sure it's tight. And it's tight. Woo wee! Get somewhere now. Go well, next. Get these legs together. See if I can show it. Um, again, I'm gonna move this up, which looks like the skirts, so I can move this out a little bit, so I can get to this leg, and you can see this leg. Oh, all right. This panel right here folds in on itself. Like that, this one folds in on itself like this, I believe, and it, I think, goes on top of each other like that. Then you fold these up. I don't know if they play a major role in anything other than trying to get it out the way. And maybe it's like this. Um, let me see. Yeah, I think it's this way. But I don't think it, it doesn't really clamp in. It just, I guess, just a major, just helps with positioning. Then you move this up like that. It's going to stay in this leg. Then you move this. It's hard to show. But when you clamp these legs, you're gonna clamp these legs together. That's what you're gonna do. Make sure, don't forget to push this up as well on this side. Um, like that. So then when you put that, it should be like this. I'm looking to see if there's any tabs on there. I don't think there's any tabs on there. I think it's just, natural so then when you pull this up you're going to fold these two together and right here is going to tab in here and here is going to tab in uh back here and then these going to clamp together so see if i can do that Trying to get it on camera, but I don't know if it's working. Because it's pretty, uh, I don't know if I got this right because it feels like it's not sturdy. 
This is coming out. Oh, I think I might have broke a tab. Oh no. Let me try to fool with this off screen because I don't wanna. If I did break a tab, oh, oh yeah, I did break a tab. Yep, broken tab right there. So be careful. That sucks, cause that's his knee. Man, that's gonna cause some stability issues, I believe. And that's great. Oh yeah, you gotta turn it like this. Because that's, this is the back, I believe. No, this is the front. This might be the front. I think you gotta turn it. Yeah, I don't know if maybe when the cars are on here, it'll be a little better. I don't know, but right now it's not great. And with that tab broke, it's not great. It's just the skirts. There's a skirt in here too. I think you gotta have to get out. Uh. So do that on both sides. It's just a side, it's a side skirt. Make sure when you're doing this, you turn it right, the right, not right, but you turn it the right way, which is uh, this way, then you won't put pressure on that joint like I did. I think that's that's why I put pressure on it. I'm not sure, but I'm gonna get this off camera because um I don't want to break anything else. Kind of at the home stretch, if you can call it that. Um, move this. Let me see. There's a panel somewhere. I'm gonna move the panel on the back here. Here we go. Panel on the back. I couldn't figure out what they were talking about. Um, pull it down. It's on the back because I turned it around. Now you have these pieces right here, and this thing. You want to pull this peg out right there. So you flip this around and there's a peg hole right there. You can see that. You flip this up again. You need to have it just right on the side. Peg that in and peg this in right here. Might have to peg it in first, kind of. Yeah. You can kind of see it. See how I flip that up and the, the pegs on the thing. Um, over here is the same way. You got that little black piece with the peg on it. In this black piece, I don't know if you can see it. Um, Cause it's gonna grab onto a piece this piece right here. So do that on both sides, just to be ready. It gets floppy, it gets floppy right here. Might have to raise the camera up, cause you're not able to see. Now you move this arm around like that. This is Can you see this? That's where that tab goes into. So if everything is lined up correctly, then you can click that tab into there. Surprising how sturdy it is even just <laughs> not together. <laughs> 
So this piece, there's a hole here and a hole in here that it has to go through all two, or all two, both of them. Uh, kind of a pain. Then again, what isn't on this figure, so. Even worse when I'm trying to get it on camera. All right, so if it's not on camera, I apologize. Super duper frustrating. I forgot, or I didn't know, it's a piece here. This has to be, you see that? Has to be set like that. Just that little bit lines up this tab right here makes this piece, where's the piece at? This piece go over top like it's supposed to and everything should line up now. Oh my gosh, that was frustrating. And I didn't see that in no directions. I don't, nobody told me, no, <laughs> nobody told me, I missed the memo. So, man. So now let me see how that works. Yep, it works perfectly. Not perfectly, but perfectly enough. Move this arm, this locking mechanism. I'm going to unlock it because I should be fine with it now. Now that I have the thing in the right spot. And it is. It goes in. Then you can lock it. Should be able to lock it in it. Yeah, it's tight. It's tight. Then I can see if I can get this even better. I don't know if I can. I see a couple stress marks on a couple places. Man, that was frustrating as I don't know what. I'm probably going to cut all that out. <laughs> because you talk about super frustrating. Like that was, that was probably one of the most frustrating things I've ever done. Because I couldn't get, I couldn't get this to line up right. I didn't know what I was doing wrong. Again, lock this a tad bit. Should go into the slot and lock it back. Yes, sir. Lock it all the way. Just so it's locked. Then you have this little thing right here that goes on. You can just finagle and stick it on there. Uh, And this slides back like this and should lock up here. The Minotaur head. You get all this stuff together. Uh, I don't even know yet if I'm putting. Yeah, I don't I don't know if I'm putting him back there. Uh, Motor master. <sighs> Just have to see. So now it's coming, coming together a little bit. Looking kind of crispy. Whew. I'm going to just flip him over real quick because I don't know how sturdy that's going to be, but we'll see. There's a piece here that you have to push in in order to bend this torso. So have these like this up. Pointing, they're kind of up, I believe. And then I think push this in. Then you bend this down like this. And it. And it is. I think it locks in somewhere. Um, there we go. Locks in there. And then in order to bend this torso, you have to and I have like stress marks on this piece right here. If you can see that, that's not good. If you want to bend this 
like that and then fold these and get them move this out the way because these are the arms uh fold these and get them plugged in to here and i think let's right let's see Then get this torso still trying to get it right. There we go. Locked in there. I don't know if this locks in somewhere or then let's get these arms together. Then how to get these arms, you pull this little flap out that's already out. You want the elbow, you know how the elbow is, and then you can get these together, sort it out. Put that up like that. Um, I think that folds in. Then you can flip that around and it tabs on. which is <laughs> the least of my worries because it's not tabbing on, of course. All right, it's on there. It just takes some, some mustard. Uh, yeah, here we go. Fold that over, fold this over. Let me be careful because <laughs> I'm at the home stretch. You know how that is. You're at the home stretch and you trying to hurry up and get it done. Uh, help if I had this hand right. And that one went on fine. And now you have the shell of Minasaur. Oh, the feet. I think the toes, the feet. Let me see. I think there's something going on with the feet. Um, so I, pu I pull this up. And I believe the toes come out. Maybe just a little bit. Uh -huh. I don't know. Got a tool right here. Yeah, those things are, are tight. If they do come out. Yeah, I believe they do. Um,
Life ain't no, life ain't no, life ain't no, life ain't no. As long as you alive, you can give another try and take it real high if you want.